was a man named Gold Roger who was king of the pirates. He had fame, power, and wealth beyond your wildest Guys, dreams. Before they hung him from the gallows, these were the I got words updates. he said. My fortune is yours for the taking, but you'll have to find it first. I left everything I Folks, owned in one piece. Ever since pirates I over the world have officially the grand line, moved on for one piece, to one of everyone's dream. favorite arcs. Yo! That's right, ladies and gentlemen, it's time for the Water 7 arc. It is upon us. That's right. I did the, the what is it, the Nickelback Jack? Uh, <coughs> Ding Dong Long Ring Island. I finished it. It was all right. Not one of my favorite arcs, but it was short. You know, it was short and sweet. And I believe we are now at Water 7, which many people have considered to be peak One Piece arc. A pivotal One Piece arc. So I'm very excited. This, uh, I can't even listen to this rap. Uh, it's just like... Someone said trash arc lol. It's the saga that's peak. Wait, what do you mean? It's just the start of the peak. The peak is the next one. Instead of touching grass, I'm watching motherfucking One Piece. Okay. I met the Admiral. I skipped the filler arc immediately after uh, Long Ring Island. I, I met the Admiral who has like this insane ice power, which is incredible. Like insane. Insane. Okay. He's sick as fuck. He's kind of cool, which is weird because, like, you know, obviously, m myself, just like Monkey D. Luffy, we're a cab, right? But he is so cool, you know? So maybe some cab. So we'll see. We'll see what happens. Um, the Afro stuff was kind of weird. I don't know if he is... You can cosplay as the ice guy, by the way. I can't because he's... I mean, that'd be doing blackface, I think. But Afro Luffy was, like, kind of weird, dude. I mean, I, I guess, like, it's, it's, like, Japanese. And technically, Luffy is Brazilian. But, like, he's white Brazilian. But, like, the way they talk about the Afro, it was weird, okay? It was odd. It was odd. It was odd. It was odd. They're like, oh, it's the Afro. His Afro is so powerful. It's the we haven't seen black people racism. Yes, yes, exactly, exactly. It's, like... It's different. It's like when you're a black dude and you go to like fucking Turkey or you go to like China or you go to Japan and everyone's like staring at you. It's that kind. You know what I mean? It's not like it's not like very clearly and deliberately being like anti-black, but it's more like, uh, yo, we're kind of fascinated with black guys. Like, what's up with that type racism? You know what I mean? Yeah. Curiosity. Curiosity racism. <laughs> It was weird, though. I was like, what the fuck's going on here? What, what's, what's going on there? What, oh, yeah. It's his afro. It's so powerful. <laughs> so that was, that was, they orientalized black people. Oh, yeah, 100%. Anyway, it was great, though. I mean, I really thought I was going to hate the, the, the Davy back fight arc because I was like, what the fuck is this shit? And I, do, I did get annoyed at times because, like, the, slow slow guy is like fucking annoying like he's not that powerful and yet he was like kind of whooping ass and it pissed me off i was like come on like you're monkey d luffy like what the fuck? you should destroy foxy like you could literally sneeze on him and, and and kill him and you're over here acting like his fruit is like in any way shape or form powerful like how did it take you 11 episodes to figure out mirrors are his like counter you know what i mean how how your whole point, like, you're not that stupid. God damn it. But uh, he is. He is that stupid. And it really pisses me off how stupid he is, like, all the fucking time, as a matter of fact. It just pissed me off, dude. But ultimately, it was kind of fun. Surely, they're not filling for the manga to catch up. No, 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 no. That wasn't a filler arc. I, I is, Wasn't that on the manga? Yeah, no. The Davy Back fight is not filler. Uh, I, the, website I, the website I look at did not cover it as filler half of it was filler there weren't even as close to as many rounds yeah i did think it was like a little long like it didn't need to be that long for sure but it's like a weird arc in general i am now in water seven and in the beginning of water seven so far and i really wanted to watch more but it was so late like as soon as nico robin got frozen i don't know what has happened since then i had to literally i was like i am getting too excited and it's already like late as fuck. and if i watch the rest of this episode I'm going to get too excited. I'm not going to be able to go to sleep. I'm such a fucking baby. I stopped myself 
from watching the rest of it. So I don't even know what the fuck's going on. Okay. I literally, I am such a fucking baby. I was like, I don't want to get overstimulated this late in the night, but this is crazy. Okay. This, this seems like a crazy arc that is upon us. Carl and, and foolish have both said water seven is like some of their favorite arcs. So I'm excited about that. You know, I trust their opinion on this shit. Carl is a gigantic weeb. So uh, we'll see what happens. But yeah, no, that was a very adult way to go about it. Yes, I was adulting and moderating my watch time. Uh, also, Vinland Saga Season 2 is coming out on Monday, which is fucking exciting. I haven't watched Chains. I haven't watched Chainsaw Man since like episode two. I want to watch that. There's just so much manga. I mean, so much anime, not manga. Sorry. Um, there is so much, so much anime to watch, so much anime to consume. I am so fucking stoked on it. Okay. Uh, anyway, so yeah, we got, we got a lot of nerdy shit going on this year. Okay. 2023, I'm letting my freak flag fly a little bit. Okay.